hi guys welcome to my channel once again today I will be talking about my one week postpartum how I am doing and all that good stuff and what to expect after a c-section so basically this past one week it was very difficult for me um, you know body aching and you know trying to breastfeed at the same time with this incision is it was hurting me and all that stuff but the good thing is I had somebody helping me with you know helping me around the house um, so that's a good thing uh, what else uh, I'm still take I was still taking my medication um, oxycodone and ibuprofen um, still drinking lots of water breastfeeding no exercising I can't lift anything that is higher than that is heavier than my baby um, what else um, yeah basically just the norm just body aching you know just it's t it was terrible that one week it was very difficult for me especially in the nighttime you know waking up feeding my baby you know not sleeping because you know the babies newborns do not they don't sleep that much you know they just sleep a little bit and they wake up and you're gonna feed you have to feed them especially if you're breastfeeding because the breast milk it digests very fast so you're just gonna have to keep on breastfeeding or supplement with a formula like me I'm really supplementing with formula especially when I'm really really tired and I want him to sleep <laughs> so I give him formula I used to, that one week past uh, one week ago I was giving him formula um, just for me to get that sleep or else I would have headaches because lack of sleep um so basically right now we're in two weeks so everything is really going on well but that's another video uh, basically what you expect after after a c-section is you will experience a lot of pain so do have do have somebody at home to help you out you know because they will not allow you allow you to lift anything um, that is heavier than your baby the doctor will not allow you to do a lot of you know things pertaining like cooking or um, you know housework they won't let you do that because your body will need to heal from a c-section which is a very aggressive procedure cutting your uterus to get your baby out versus pushing your baby out the normal way for vaginal birth is totally different you will swell up a lot you will swell up like I swelled up so much last week it was terrible I couldn't walk like my feet were swollen especially my left my left leg it was terrible like I could feel the pain on my leg trying to walk so I had to stay up elevated drink I drink a, I drank a lot of water to flash it out and so thank God now two weeks is really well like I'm beginning to feel like myself again um, but that's another video <laughs> so basically you know just have somebody there to help you out don't cook don't try to do anything you know slow it down let your body heal it only takes by the second week your body will f will feel much much better your swelling will go away and you'll be able to do like the norm still cannot lift anything that is heavier than your baby because again you don't want to rapture your incision and go back again and, and have it all stitched up again so no so during that first week you have to make an appointment for your doctor to get your staples out and if you have staples on your incision you know she will he or she will take them out and you know you'll be fine she'll probably let you um have um cocoa butter put it in there because that's what my doctor told me to put cocoa butter and i'll be fine um bathe um you're gonna have to wash up and all that good stuff um basically that's it guys first week it was tough but we did it so we're now on the second week and it's just getting better so guys until next time uh, thank you guys for watching my videos and also I'm happy that I'm helping some of y'all out there so if you do plan having a c-section just be prepared you know it's an aggressive um, procedure cutting your uterus and cutting all your abdomen ab you know the lower abdominal muscles so again that's why they don't let you exercise until six weeks or eight weeks postpartum basically if you're healing from a c-section it will take you about six to eight weeks for your uterus to actually go down and to go you know to shrink up to its normal size and then you know your ab abdominal muscles that are you know down there um 
that will take a while to heal so just take it slow if you start exercising take it slow because you don't want to hurt yourself you know so yeah so basically that's it guys um, I'm, I'm, I promise you I am done with this video because I gotta go do other stuff until next time guys please do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos just like these until next time bye